So why is having an attitude of gratitude important? That's the question I posed to you this week in my short coffee chat. And I want to follow that up with a little video information that can help you with your attitude of gratitude. I'm Dr. Boomer Brown with Doing Good at Work. And thanks for taking a few minutes of your time to join me today for one thought. So why is it important to have an attitude of gratitude? Well, it sets up your whole day for success. You know, attitudes, I hear a lot of people say that attitudes are bad or they're either good. Well, the truth is they're neither bad nor good. What they are is energy sources. When someone has a positive attitude, they're leaning towards something favorably. And when they have a negative attitude, they're leaning towards something negatively. Well, your attitude of gratitude can be one of the sources that helps you have a positive energy attitude every day. Let me give you just a little example in my own personal life. You know, some Mondays I might get up on the wrong side of the bed and I might go to work and I might not really be wanting to go to work. So my attitude is negatively charged and I'm leaning in the wrong direction. But you know, if I wake up that way and I recognize that's what's happening, I have a choice at that point to make. I can choose to turn on my attitude of gratitude and I can say, man, I'm glad I've got work to go to today. I'm glad I've got clients to see or to support or to help. I'm glad I've got some problems today because it may help me use my creativity to solve those and to help others. So all of a sudden, my attitude of gratitude is giving me positive energy so that my whole attitude is now positive. So I want you to think about this week uh, as you go through your work week and the next few weeks we're going to talk about uh, gratitude and how important that is. And the one thing I want you to think about today to make this possibly practical is this. What can I be grateful for? If you'll think about that a little bit, I bet you can find a list of things that you can be grateful for. And that will help you cultivate that positive attitude or that attitude of gratitude. Thanks for joining me today, and I hope to see you next week on A Coffee Chat.